Greetings, fellow traveler. Today, I want to remind you of the power of patience. It's okay to allow things to work out in their own divine timing. In this world where there are so many different tools and uh, ways to get what we believe we want, we can get caught up in the idea of having some kind of power over the outside world, which is true to an extent. But being able to slow oneself down and understand that the things that one wishes to come into their life or that they wish to have upon their journey, it must come as long as you truly desire it. We don't get to choose how or when it comes. So it's not only about being patient, but it's also about being open to the reality of it coming to you. Being open to the fact that God does work in mysterious ways. Being open to the fact that the answer may come by means that you currently don't know of. And that's okay. If nobody ever told you that, that is okay. Because in this world, as I feel like it has been since the dawn of this world, there's already, there's already so many out, outside forces that are telling us how it should be or how things ought to go. But we are divine beings. We come from the God that you believe in, no matter what God you believe in. And knowing that you have a, a spark of that power within you that powers your entire life, your entire vehicle of this body that you're in. There comes a certain knowing that you can do a lot more than what you believe. Sometimes that means doing something new. A majority of the time it does. And sometimes you can do the same thing, but with a different kind of energy. You can go to the same job that you have. You can go uh, experience the same relationships that you have. But you can shift your perspective to a perspective of gratitude, of understanding, of grace. Now, that's not the same as settling. That's about shifting your perspective just a little bit. And in doing so, you might realize that things aren't as bad as you believe or vice versa. You might realize that some environments, relationships are worse than you could imagine. Either way, it's fine. But be open to the minute changes that introduce themselves to you along the journey. Because having patience with yourself allows you to take those teaching moments, those learning moments with a bit of grace. And you don't have to worry about condemning yourself or anybody else. You don't have to beat up yourself for uh, actions or missteps. Nah, it's not about that. Life is nothing but a consistent journey. Even if you physically sit in one spot, it's still a journey. It's a spiritual, mental journey. So remember that although we're stuck in this realm where time does have a say-so, and truthfully, you're on God's time. You're on God's time. And that means things can come in an instant. Sometimes things take a little bit longer as we perceive it. But to God, it's all instant. It's all instant. So know that no matter what wins or losses you do encounter in life, it's all subjective. It's all about what you do with the information that you have received. Sometimes that does put you in a in a better situation. Other times it does put you in what appears to be a worse situation. But it's about how you maneuver through all of these things that truly show you who you are. More importantly, it supports the power that you know is within you. Because no matter how much running away we may attempt to do with certain uh, aspects of our life, we're always going to be confronted with the root of the problem, which is something within self. This is not about self bashing. It's about understanding that every interaction that we experience in our reality has one common denominator, ourselves. 
So if we see ourselves in certain situations more often than not, then there must be something that we could change. There must be a perspective we could change, or there may be a way of maneuvering through our journey that we can shift just a little bit, just a little bit to get a better sense of direction. I tell you all the time, it's not about being perfect. It's not even about right or wrong. It's a reminder to stay within your true power as much as possible. Be patient with yourself and know that divine timing is always working in your favor. So trust and believe. It's what it comes down to. Trust and believe. Until next time, be blessed, y'all. And please don't forget to smile.